I'm outside enjoying the beautiful day. It's absolutely gorgeous outside. Yes, I do love messing with the filters, <laughs> as you can tell. It's a lot of fun for me. Just looking at the dogs, they're running around. <laughs> I know you're not hearing them because they're both staring at me at the very moment. <laughs> They were just running around. It's so beautiful outside. Like, it's it's winter. This is my season. I love the season. Um, there's something special about Christmas, of course. It has to do with the birth of Jesus Christ. But even though, you know, technically he wasn't born in the month of December, there is this morning, there's this, like, kind of, like, beautiful... Um, magic like I don't know, around the whole entire Christmas season um, just make sure they're okay <laughs> just play um, you just you, you find that what are you two doing what are you two doing they're chasing each other and barking. You get to enjoy the beauty of the season. I live on the East Coast, so it's... Let me move. <laughs> so you'd be able to hear me because they're not going to move unless I move. You get to enjoy the beauty of you know, um, the winter season. And I live on the East Coast, so it gets very cold, it gets snowy, it gets, you know, that kind of way. So it's really nice to be able to have, um, I don't know, I just, I love winter. I love the season of Christmas, Thanksgiving, New Year's. I even love up until, you know, um, valentine's day it's and i think it's a superficial day <laughs> i think they're all superficial <laughs> but i also tend to think that you can make your um, holiday a beautiful wonderful experience by not giving so much into the superficial things of the season like just buying gifts and you know being grateful for Jesus Christ who died on the cross for you who was born into this world to save you from sin that's kind of like how I see it you know that to me is the beauty of the holiday season and I know many people don't believe in Jesus Christ I know pe many people don't believe in in God or anything like that I feel sorry <laughs> for you people <laughs> but um i think also i have hope for a lot of people out there that will find um god eventually and i think it will happen hopefully <laughs> i pray for that um sometimes when you look at all the evil that's happening in the world he's the only one that ever makes me feel that um there is better things to come so i don't think mankind humans can ever truly um continue the way we're going we will destroy ourselves before that but i do believe that um in god and and, and people say higher power but i believe in god <laughs> and I believe in Jesus Christ. So I won't confess, like, belittle the name of God um, to some higher power. I believe it's God. But I do think that when you do hold on to something as faith, and you do hold on to Christianity, when you hold on to God and the creator of all things, you learn to appreciate things a little bit better and see the world from a different perspective. I hope 
that you all can enjoy that beauty. I hope you can enjoy that time that you get to have a chance to get to know God and be grateful. That is exactly why I love this season because it kind of celebrates his birthday and yes, it may not be in the month of December, but the fact that we even celebrate it at all to me is an accomplishment. And I know there's a whole bunch of people that are like pagans, blah, blah, blah. You know, you can make it into whatever you make it into. You can make it about just about gifts. You could make it about what you get. <laughs> you could do all that. But for me, the greatest gift was the day that Jesus Christ came into this world to die for all of us. And I hope you remember that the next time that you are shopping or doing all the things that you do for this season. Have a nice day, everybody. Bye.